Hey guys, Sock here from Sock eTech, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about some powerful applications designed to improve the performance of your Samsung Galaxy smartphone. These are 100% free applications made by Samsung for Samsung phones. And if you don't have them, you're missing out. So I'm talking about applications like this one right over here, which allows you to optimize your apps using software technologies that are able to improve the phone's performance by up to 13.3% or 15% based on which options you choose. And I'm also talking about some enhanced memory management that is going to make your phone perform better. So let's dive in and get started right away. So to download the applications, what you wanna do is you wanna click the link down below. Once you click the link, you are gonna be at my website. And you can see here's a Good Guardians application, which is a suite of powerful Samsung applications. So scroll down under download, click the link. Now when you click the link, It'll take you to the Galaxy Store from where you can download the Good Guardians. And then at the bottom, tap on Install. Now once it's installed, what you want to do is you want to tap on Open. And what you are going to see is a suite of six applications. Even though this is something I don't use, but these five are very important. But in this video, I'm going to showcase these three options that I've been recently using on my other Samsung phones. But of course you can download any one of these and play with it to see what's going on. Now, first and foremost, if you wanna download a specific module of the Good Guardians application, all you do is you tap on the shop icon, okay? If you don't see the shop icon, that means it's already installed. If you see the shop icon, you tap on it, it'll again take you to the store and you are able to install that battery module okay once it is installed you can see the shop disappears so that one is installed now let me quickly show you this one right here first that is the memory guardian so i'm going to tap on this guy and you can see it gives me an option to clean up the memory which makes the performance of the phone better and i do want to compare this if i go to my settings scroll down to device care I want to compare it to the built-in memory management in the device care. Look at the difference. Here, I'm getting an option to clean two gigabytes. But on the memory guardian, with the good guardians, I'm able to clean up to 3.42 gigabytes. So this is, in fact, a more enhanced, deeper application for enhanced memory management. And you will be able to tap over here and see some useful information. In fact, if you read this, you'll understand why this is a very important application to manage and guard your memory. And you can also go over here and you can customize, you can do a quick switching mode, speed up top app mode, and all that stuff, as you can see. So I want you guys to play with all these settings, but that is the memory guardian. Now, if I were to go back to my Good Guardians, okay, there is another one that is the Galaxy App Booster. So when I tap on this one, basically, I can, I can tap this option that says Optimize Now, and just by doing it, I am getting a 15% improvement in performance just by tapping Optimize Now on 581 applications. Now, I do want to show you something very cool here. If you tap this button... It says, we suggest you run the Galaxy App Booster right after OS upgrade and after that, once per week to maximize performance. This is gonna make sure apps are optimized to respond even faster, launch faster, work faster, and all that good stuff. Now, you can also optimize apps using the past 30 days only. So if I tap on this one, the phone knows the apps that were used on my phone in the last 30 days. This is standard apps and also system apps. That's why that number is so high. And you can optimize those instead of all the apps on your phone, okay? So give it a try, see what kind of performance boost you get. And then the final app I'm gonna talk about, again, you can download all these applications, is the Battery Guardian. That is to extend your battery life. So tap on it, and basically all you do is you enable app power saving. If I go inside, it says that when battery draining app has been found, app will be put to sleep automatically to extend your battery life, okay? So again, that's going to be deeper than what you have 
in your actual battery options. You also have the option to auto dim applications. Again, you go inside and look at this. It says when screen is not used, enter dim mode quickly and keep dim until screen timeout. So let's say your screen timeout is 30 seconds, but you want your app to dim faster than that to preserve battery. You can do that with this application. Just tap on get started and it'll, it'll walk you through. So again, it is going to extend the battery life because display is something that eats most battery life. And then look at this, standard refresh rate apps. If I tap on this one, I'm able to choose certain applications that can only run at 60 hertz. So you lock away the 120 for those apps and they will run at 60, thereby saving you battery. So tap on plus. All right, and you can choose any app that you want. Then you tap on add, and these applications will now run at 60 and no more than that. Again, this is just an example, but you get the idea. I'm gonna turn that off for now, all right? And then you have all these other options like network power savings, power saving during bedtime, and extend battery life. So many details you can modify to increase the life of your phone and increase and boost the performance. All right, guys, any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now. Have a fantastic day.